I know you've done this on the Orange and Brown Talk podcast. Do you think it's time to kind of raise the expectations for the Browns? You know, I've always had pretty high expectations for the Cleveland Browns this year, so I don't know that I need to raise them uh, from where I've always been. I have always thought when I look out at this talent, and I know a lot of people might not feel this way because it's the Browns and they still have a lot to prove, but when I look out at Miles Garrett, Denzel Ward, Martin Emerson, Grant Delpit, Juan Thornhill, Greg Newsome, JOK, all these guys, Nick Chubb, the guards, Deshaun, Amari, Elijah. I mean, when I'm rattling this off, I mean, these are talented football players. And if it comes together on the field the way that it's supposed to, they should be challenging for the playoffs. They should be challenging to win the AFC North. I mean, there's no reason why they can't go out and and beat the Bengals. We know they already have. I mean, we know that the Browns are one. the The Browns are four and one against Joe Burrow in his career. So they know they can beat them. And then you know Lamar, he always gives the Browns a tough time. But um, and the Steelers, they're they're always very difficult. But I do think uh, that the Browns have all the talent that it takes. Uh, to accomplish some really great things this season. And I just don't see any reason why they shouldn't be winning 10, maybe even 11 games.